Hey, so for today's video, I wanted to talk about the XWM. Now, it is basically a package that turns Emacs into a window manager, that's it. And as we said, it can communicate directly to X applications, as you might expect. Um, one of the things that I really enjoy about it is that I can define custom, you know, key presses or bindings, and EXWM is going to replicate it along all your X applications. So one of the things that I find really annoying is whenever I have to use a certain, I mean, a graphical application, is that it has its own custom set of bindings, and I have to rebind a lot of them. I just, I mean, for, for me, that's annoying, right? So let me show you what I mean by that. So this is a terminal, and first I'd like to mention that uh, EXLEA has char and line mode. So char mode is basically pass-through in the sense that it's going to send the input directly to the X application, and line mode is the opposite. It's going to masquerade if it, I mean, if you define it in your in your configuration file that way. So what I mean is that I can type anything, you know, numbers or you know whatever, but if I switch the the mode to 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 line, then I can use my custom bindings to you know navigate in the in the X application. So this is you know text editing. So I can go to the beginning and I can delete a character, or I can go to the previous command with P and N. You know, again, super useful because I don't have to worry about whatever it is that you know. For instance, the guys that developed LX terminal thought it was a good key binding. So it's it basically a way of you know generalizing your key bindings across your X application. So another practical example, let me fire up a uh, you know a web browser. I'm just gonna do a random you know search in Google, and here it's the same. I, I could use the arrow keys to navigate in here, but if I go to line mode, I can use FNPB, you know, to go to the next the line, the previous line, or maybe the next page or the previous page with uh, with uh, uh, V and uppercase V. Uh, v. It works as well with you know text boxes. Let's say that I was editing, you know, this thing over here. Notice that I'm in char mode at the moment. I'm gonna turn it off, and then I can use the bindings that I was talking about before. So I can go, you know, the previous character, I can go forward, I can delete a word, or I can delete the whole line with K. And that, like I said, it, that works across your X applications. There might be some extra tweaking that you need to do for some applications. Uh, that's fairly possible, but I haven't encountered, encountered that many problems, at least the way that I manage things. So hopefully this gives you a little bit of insight of what EX somebody WM is capable of, and you know if you try it out and you have a question for me that I can help you with, just let me know. And thanks for watching.